Assalamualaikum and a very good afternoon. Today we are going to look at a new topic, safety at home. Now, what is safety at home means? Alright, safety is a word from... The base word for safety is safe. Perkataan dasar bagi safety ialah safe. Safe ni seperti yang kamu tahu, maksudnya apa? Selamat. Yes, at home. At home is associated with house. Home, house. Home and house is similar. Jadi, kamu tahu perkataan house, definitely you know home. Okay? Safety, house. So, kamu boleh agak ya. Safety di uh, keselamatan di rumah. Safety at a house or safety at home, keselamatan di rumah. Now, before we proceed, let us look at words that will be very relative dengan keselamatan di rumah. The word like socket, S-O-C-K-E-T, socket. I think you know the socket. Kamu tengok gambar tu. Kalau kamu nak charge cek phone kamu pun, kamu perlukan socket. Right. Uh, or laptops. And banyak barangan elektrik yang lain. The next word is matches. Matches ialah mancis. Ah, uh, Saya tak pasti kamu masih lagi guna mancis ke tidak. Uh, mungkin ada yang tahu apa itu mancis kan? Next, the word is burn. B-U-R-N. Burn. Right, burn ni ialah terbakar. Ya. Yeah? Dan bila terbakar, especially kalau kat tangan, dia akan melecur lah. Right, the next is oven. O-V-E-N is oven. 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 Bukan oven. Oven. And tungku atas oven ni, biasanya atas oven dia ada tempat macam tungku ya. Yeah? And that one is called hob. H-O-B, hop. Alright, now have a look at the uh, words here. Now, uh, abaikan yang nama satu. Teacher yang akan baca. You don't have to listen uh, today. You just have to listen to me. Kamu hanya dengar teacher hari ni. Uh, there are uh, words here or a sentence. Stay safe at home by following these easy rules. Rules, undang-undang atau peraturan ya. So, stay safe lah kalau kamu ikut peraturan ni, right? Now, uh, yeah, I would like to highlight the word here. Um, let's have a look at the word. Um, shouldn't, alright? The word shouldn't, alright? I'm going to highlight the word shouldn't here. Shouldn't ni. Uh, adalah perkataan yang asalnya ialah should not S H O U L D should not okey dia sama dengan oh, sorry sama dengan shouldn't and apostrophe apostrophe koma kat atas tu kita panggil apostrophe shouldn't should not or shouldn't So, itulah dua perkataan dan kita panggil ini contraction. Okay, this one we call it contraction. Shouldn't. Kependekannya, ya. Now, you look at uh, number one. You shouldn't play with knives. Now, kalau kamu tengok dekat sini, uh, cuba kamu uh, perhatikan uh, manakah gambar yang sesuai untuk di, uh, di I mean, uh, it's match with kenyataan number one. You shouldn't play with knives. Ada berapa gambar ni? Ada A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Ada tujuh gambar. There are seven pictures here. Which one match with the first statement? You shouldn't play with knives. Kamu jangan ya. Kamu tidak patut main dengan knives. Knives ni, uh, apa? I'm not going to tell you. Now, you look at number two. You shouldn't touch cleaning products. Cleaning products. Okay, kamu tak patut uh, sentuh eh. Uh, produk 
pembersihan kadang-kadang beracun dan sebagainya kadang-kadang meluka akan bagi uh, masalah pada kulit kamu dan sebagainya you shouldn't touch cleaning products so have a look which one number three you shouldn't play with matches ha, tak patut kamu main dengan matches number four you shouldn't touch the oven when it is hot when it's hot manakah gambar dia number five you shouldn't run up and down the stairs Ya, yeah, shouldn't. Jangan berlari uh, naik atau turun dari tangga. Very dangerous, ya. Yeah? Ha, teacher pernah ada anak murid juga yang patah tangan dan sebagainya. Oh, it's very dangerous. Ha, dekat rumah kamu kalau ada tangga, kan? Please, don't run up and down. Ha, number six, you shouldn't jump on your bed. Ha, tolonglah jangan uh, jump on your bed. Katil, ha, jam, ha, ada yang melompat-lompat dan sebagainya. Ya di rumah habis roboh katil. Number seven, you shouldn't play with sockets. Ha, janganlah main dengan soket tu sebabnya soket ni biasanya dia ada aliran kuasa elektrik tu. Kita tak tahu sama ada dia uh, wire dia masih elok ataupun ada sakit dekat situ ya. Ha, kalau ada short sakit, kamu pegang tu dia. Hmm. Tak adalah nanti. Kalau alirannya uh, sikit apa? Kalau alirannya banyak, uh, mungkin kamu keras kat situ lah jawabnya. So, these are the rules that you are to follow uh, in in your house, at home. Uh, sebenarnya banyak lagi safety dekat mana-mana dan sebagainya. So, our focus today is uh, to have a look at safety at home. Okay? Yang kamu boleh uh, buat di rumah lah. Okay. What you can do at home. Okay. Now, what you are going to do today. Apa yang kamu perlu buat hari ni ialah. Uh, first of all. Pastikan kamu tulis perkataan ni. Socket, matches, burn and oven. And another word of course. Hop. Okey, nak lukis, lukislah. Tak nak lukis pun tak apa. Tapi pastikan kamu tulis uh, maksudnya dekat tepi tu. Ya. Yeah. Uh, matches tu apa, burn and all. Right. Next, don't forget. Oh, ya. Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh, definitely. Satu benda, please. Janganlah lupa tulis tarikh, ya. Yeah. Uh, hari dan tarikh. Don't forget to write down here. Right. For example, today is Tuesday. Please. T yang pertama tu, tentulah huruf. Besar capital letter. And of course, uh, you need to come up with the date. 28 September 2021. Alright, don't forget the day and date. Right? And after that, uh, please write down the, the topic here. Uh, tolong tulis topik ni. Safety at home. Alright? And then, safety at home by following these rules. Uh, tulis, number one, you shouldn't play with knives. Uh, what is the answer for that? Now, you have to look at the answer for that. Then, number two, right, and so on and so on. Alright, kamu perlu tahu. Number two, apa dia? Number three, okay. Uh, kalau kamu tengok, there are seven all together. Then, please, uh, match the picture. Dan kamu tak perlulah lukis gambar. You don't have to. You hanya lukis, uh, tulis macam saya cakap tadi. Number one, number two, the statement. Kenyataan tu mesti tulis lah. Right? And as for today, the values is always follow safety rules at home. Always follow safety rules at home. Dia kata, selalu patuh pada uh, peraturan keselamatan di rumah. Sebenarnya banyak ya uh, peraturan lagi di luar sana but what we are going to focus is our home at the moment. Now you can look at uh, you know at a clearer picture kalau kamu nak tengok lebih jelas lagi please turn to page 106. Hmm, tadi teacher lupa nak highlightkan tadi ya right? So of course today we are going to focus uh, on page 106. Okay, 106. 
uh, mungkin tadi teacher dah uh, masukkan dalam WhatsApp dan sebagainya. Right? I tell you uh, the topic for today. So, I guess that's about all. Uh, please focus on this page only. That's about all today. Boys and girls, have a pleasant day. Goodbye.